Hello, and welcome to the Courtyard by Marriott, downtown Fort Lauderdale. My name is Hannah, and I am the art curator here at the hotel. We are in the heart of Fort Lauderdale's up-and-coming art district, Flagler Village. This area has become a real hub for local artists. There's art studios, galleries, and other businesses nearby that fall into the creative category. Our hotel is very passionate about supporting this growth of the local artists, and contributing to the rich history of Flagler Village. Today, I will be guiding you through our latest exhibition titled Uncover by local South Florida artist Brandon Clark. This exhibition explores the power unleashed when you uncover who you really are. Brandon Clark lives and works from Homestead, which is just south of Miami, Florida. A second generation artist, Clark grew up inspired by his grandmother, who kept a family journal in the form of paintings. Clark was always drawn to art, and he ended up pursuing a career in architecture where he expressed his creativity. Then, in 2020, he reclaimed his artistic identity during the pandemic, a time where society was in many ways forced to introspect. Many people turned to creative outlets during this time as a way to occupy themselves during the worldwide lockdown, but also found that art is a useful way to work through difficult emotions. Through Clark's art practice came healing, empowerment, freedom, and authenticity. This exhibition features a collection of early works by Clark, his entry into artistic expression, and his stylistic evolution. As you enter our lobby, the first piece of art you're going to see is this big, colorful, yet minimal piece. This piece is called Particle. The use of these bold colors circling and blending together creates a feeling of energy flow and balance. A particle is an extremely tiny piece of matter, and this painting puts into perspective the energy that is present in every tiny particle. The artist described to me that everything in the universe is made up of particles, and this painting expresses the collective power. You will notice that many of Clark's earlier works in the show are acrylic on canvas and more simplistic in their approach. Let's view another early work that showcases this technique. Then later, we will compare it with a later work to notice the ways Clark's style has evolved. Clark strives to inspire others with his fearless approach to creation. This exhibition celebrates the journey of self-discovery and invites viewers to look within to uncover lost parts of themselves, just as the artist did while creating the artwork. Let's walk over to the Quantum Restaurant to view some more early works. Take a look at the painting to the far left titled A Bright Spot on a Cloudy Day. In this painting, the artist begins to introduce spray paint, adding some visual texture to the work. Created during the pandemic, much of Clark's early art was an escape. Here, the title can be interpreted as a metaphor. The world was experiencing a period of collective sorrow and grief. Clark emphasizes the importance of finding positivity during hard times, finding a bright spot on a cloudy day. You can also see this exemplified visually. The white paint shines through on the left side of the painting, beaming over the other elements in the piece. Now let's take a look at a few of Clark's more recent pieces that exemplify a significant shift in his artwork. As you enter the lobby, you'll see this smaller pink piece titled How to Live. This piece signifies a transition in style from the acrylic pieces we saw before to now using different materials and the use of words on the artwork to convey a strong message. Here, the artist begins to experiment with recycled materials that enlighten the message even further. The use of a shower curtain over the artwork is a symbol of the artist's transparency and vulnerability. Through this unique inclusion, the artist asserts that people should live boldly, and in order to do that, you must become vulnerable. Let's walk over to our main gallery wall near the restaurant to examine another piece that takes this approach. Clark's large piece titled Just Believe is another example of this transition into his newer style. Again, we see the use of the shower curtain draped over the painting as a symbol of Clark's feeling of exposure. 
you can ask yourself, what are the ways in your life that you can become more vulnerable? And how does the feeling of vulnerability help you discover lost parts of yourself? Personal growth requires the ability to release and let go of what no longer serves us. And through this, we can truly uncover who we really are. This new style of expression for Clark was a breakthrough in his practice. I encourage you all to explore the exhibition to further examine this and do your own research on the artist to see how his artwork has continued to evolve and tackle new themes that are authentic to him. Brandon Clark has had multiple exhibitions in the greater Miami area and beyond. His exhibition titled Black Card, Transactions in Cultural Currency at Hamptons Art Lovers received attention from national media outlets and boldly shows Clark's continued growth in his artwork as he gained the confidence to tackle complex subjects like what it means to be black in the 21st century. To recap, Brandon Clark is an American artist who strives to uncover deep inner and collective truths by exposing what's hidden. This exhibition displays his early works from 2020 and 2021 when the artist first followed his call to create art and began to delve into his authenticity. You can find Brandon Clark and learn more online at BrandonClarkDesigns.com and on Instagram at BrandonClarkArt underscore. All the works on display are for sale. If you are interested in purchasing, please contact the artist directly. 100% of the art sales at the courtyard go to the artist. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to you for attending this art tour. I hope you felt inspired by the art we viewed and enjoyed learning more about this incredible up and coming artist. Our art exhibitions rotate every six months. Stay tuned and follow us on Instagram to get updates about the show as an opening event. You can also join our art mailing list by giving your email to the front desk. I also encourage you to explore the rest of Fort Lauderdale's dynamic art and culture scene. Take a walk around the neighborhood and go into some of those art galleries, visit the NSU Art Museum, and ask our team about upcoming art events at the hotel. Thank you again for joining me today. I hope you have a fantastic visit.